The reason a cult leader or a group leader creates an enemy is to get tighter bonding within the group. Every cult practically is an us against them. So that if it's a Bible-based group, the outside world are sinners and satanic and bad folks, and we are the good ones. So that the more that leaders speak in globalities, the more they keep you from thinking critically. And then, pretty soon, you're almost trained like a pet dog. He speaks of Satan, and everybody knows you're supposed to think the outside world is bad because the leader just used that charged word. And so here's the deal. God has always been about absolute truths. Yes. There's a heaven, there's a hell. There's no in-between. There is light and there's darkness. There's no in-between. Jesus says you're building on the rock or you're building on the sand. There's no in-between. And we live in a time that wants to make things all kind of gray. So that we can feel better about ourselves, but Revelation makes it clear. You got the mark of the beast or you got the seal of God. Are you with me right here?